Many athletes who have played high school basketball in the local area have continued their careers at successful programs in conferences like the Big Ten, Big East, or even the Missouri Valley Conference to name a few. However, it's not often we see these talented hoopers end up in the Ivy League or other schools with such high-level academics. For Bennett Academy boys basketball players Nico Abusara and Braden Fagbemi, that is exactly the case. Standing at 6 foot 5, Abu Sara has developed into one of the best all-around players in the state, while Fagbemi has gone from a supporting role to becoming a terrific point guard this season. He and Abu Sara work very well together on the court, helping the Red Wings to a 31 and 1 record so far. As the top-ranked team in Class 4A in the state of Illinois, Bennett just won a regional championship for a third straight season. But it's not just about what they do in basketball, but also in the classroom, which has given them the chance to keep competing in college. Abu Sara will be playing in the Ivy League for Dartmouth College, where he will study economics, while Fagbemi will be heading to Division III at Johns Hopkins University to be a pre-med major. As an athlete, my body and like how my how my body works has been um, like of interest to me uh, for a while. And then for like choosing Johns Hopkins, it was just more um, the relationship I had with the coaches. Um, I had a great relationship with Coach uh, Josh Leffler, um, and ultimately that's what it came down to. Love hanging out with the team, and it was a great place. When I went, when I went to go visit there, uh, the coaches, uh, the players, um, just like the staff overall and the school overall, just made me feel like home. I'm Serbian too, so there was definitely uh, there's two Serbian players on the team, so I just have a great connection and it really broke my game down as a point guard, which I really liked. That's right. After playing forward and center this year for Bennett, he will be moving to point guard for the Big Green, which shows how high level the Ivy League is. He will be the first Red Wing under head coach Gene Highcamp to join the conference. Ivy League schools and Johns Hopkins do not provide athletic scholarships, which shows how dedicated you need to be to your sport and to your studies in order to compete at these elite colleges. First of all, it's quite an achievement in itself to, to have a chance to go to those schools and play, play basketball at a high level. So it takes a lot. It takes a lot throughout their high school years, and obviously it's going to take a lot once they get there. But I'm very proud of the effort that they put into, first of all, in the classroom and then on the court. And they exemplify the best in really high school student athletes. Abu Sara and Fagbemi are hyped for their chances to attend such prestigious schools. I'm super excited, you know, uh, just just to be in front of that that environment where I get to play against Harvard, Yale, Princeton every single year for the next four years of my life. Uh, it means everything to me. Um, the academic reputation that they have already, and then um, going to a, a very good school um, for basketball as well. It's everything I've dreamed for. Before they move on to the next chapters of their lives, the job is not finished for these two stars at Bennett Academy. We have all the momentum right now. The regular season really brought us together where we've been down by bad teams. We've been up by a lot of good teams, so um, just to win a state championship. So that's, that's the ultimate goal. That's what we want. When you think about Bennett boys basketball, you think about greatness. You think about dominance, talent, culture, and brotherhood. You also think about all of the great players who have worn the red and white, like Frank Kaminsky, Dave Sobolewski, Sean O'Mara, and current senior Brady Kunkup. By proving they belong among these legendary names, the future could not be brighter for Nico Abusara and Braden Fagbemi. For Naperville Sports Weekly, I'm Josiah Schuneman.